Hi everybody, so I got some exciting stuff coming in. So um, I recently just ordered a bunch of books from bookshop.com. Um, so uh, basically, here's the big box of book I ordered. Um, if you know me, one thing I love more than art and stuff is definitely like, you know, um, books and everything. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna do like an unboxing video and just go over the books that I purchased and everything and we'll go from there so so beautiful guys okay so there's some books in here that I read already but I just want to like purchase to have an actual copy for myself and everything so okay so I'm a little receipt oh no okay so here's one of the books it's so pretty guys I read this i saw it at the bookstore and or I saw it at the library checked out and everything but I'm kind of disappointed because look at that Ooh, yeah I know I kind of this is why I don't really like ordering books I guess you can say um online and everything because stuff like this can happen I mean good thank goodness it's just like the outside but you know like that's so oh that's a bit disappointing um but yeah I, I guess what really matters is what's on the inside so um, ugh, God, that's so bad though. I kind of wish that was like, look at that. That's the only cons of, I guess, you know, ordering books and stuff instead of actually going to the actual bookstore and picking up yourself and everything. So I don't know how I feel about that. We'll see. Um, but that's one of them. Um, another one I ordered is Blankets by Craig Thompson. Uh, I've been wanting to actually just read it and um, have a copy for myself so I can like refer back to and everything. So this is definitely a big graphic novel that I'll be have to get through eventually. Um, here's another one. This is called Little Red Wolf by Emile or Emile Flaches. Um, he's like a French artist and everything, and I've you know, follow him and his work and everything. And I just, I heard that this book was like, oh, so beautiful, beautifully done. Like, look at that, it's so beautiful. So it's kind of like, I guess a picture book-ish kind of format. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to read it and have it make it as part of my collection and everything. So just that one. And another one I ordered. Okay, so I read this at the library. Goodbye Autumn, Hello Winter by Kennard Pak. I love, love, love. I think this is my favorite one. I was like, he has like the four seasons one. So from, you know, autumn to winter or winter to spring and spring to summer. But I feel like this is my favorite one just because he illustrated it so beautifully. I mean, like here, let me show you. Like, look, look at that, it's so beautiful. Um, yeah, so I'm excited to actually have this in my collection and everything. And I am glad that this one didn't wrinkle as badly as the top one. I think because the first one, it was on top, so it probably got thrown around too much. But, like, all these, like, hardcovers that I ordered. So, hopefully, they all turn out good and not too badly damaged. Um, here's another that one that I've been meaning to get. Oh, it's so cute. It has, like, a little snow glitter. It's called, um, Snow Globe Wishes. And I think I mainly got this one because, like, like the art looks so pretty, guys. And I just wanted to keep it. Look how beautiful that is. So I just want, sometimes I just buy books because they're so pretty. And, you know, I can always pull them up for, like, inspiration and everything. So, um, like, look at that. That's a beautiful spread. So, yeah, I'm excited to read this one and, you know, add it to my collection and everything. <gasps> Another one I got was this. This is called Snow. Oh my god, it has like a foil kind of. Oh, I just love this. It's so beautiful. So, again, I bought this book because, first of all, it looked really pretty. And so, like, look at even the inside. It's just so simple, but so pretty. Um, but yeah, I mainly bought it because I thought the pictures were stunning. And I just really wanted books to like look at and be inspired by. and um whatnot so like, just look at how beautiful that is beautiful okay i know if you see a trend i, I love books that both snow and anything like nature is beautiful okay so here's another one that i finally got my hands
Jin Sun, um, The Most Beautiful Thing by Kao Kao Ying, is shared by um, Kuo Le, Kuo Le. Sorry, I'm butchering the name, but yeah, um, this is like, I got the map into the world, so I was really, really excited to finally get this one, and oh, look at that, beautiful, like I said, I love me some beautiful books, so that's totally, totally beautiful, and I can't wait to actually, um, read this, and like, you know, have it a part of my collection and everything, so, yay, more Hmong books in my collection, um, next one here is this one i decided to be a little bit responsible with my purchase <laughs> and purchase like some uh business boutique by uh chrissy Wright. so i um listened to the day ramsey show and basically talk about finances and like you know that and kind of like getting your life together and um uh, one of the hosts or people they have on there is chrissy Wright, and she's like talks about it's pretty much just like a woman's guide from making money and doing what she loves so i feel like I kind of want to kind of, you know, I've been eyeing this book for a while and I feel like I just finally was able to just finally pick it up and like hopefully it can give me some insight and to growing my business and everything. And last but not least, ah, I got two cute, uh, this is like a series, so this is part one, this is part two. So do not feed the squirrel in Apple of My Pie uh, by Mika Song. So I follow Mika on her Instagrams and what not too so um her work is so adorable guys and uh, like uh, just look at this hardcover graphic novel that's so like cool so her work is really really you know i would say like it's so cute and simple and i just can't wait to read these so i've been eyeing these two books and stories for a while now so i'm, I'm glad i'm able to finally um you know get them and read them and you know i think these will be perfect for my kids once they get older and get into um graphic novels and everything so look at how cute that is so yeah that's basically me unboxing all my um books and everything like i said i'm really really happy with my purchase except for that one first book that came out kind of um you know ruined and everything so um but yeah we'll i will definitely you know give these a read and um thanks for watching hope you guys enjoy bye